Hello, I'm here to pick up a prescription, please. Hello, my name is Tiffany. I'm the pharmacist here today. Hi. And are you picking up for yourself or someone else? Uh, it's not for me, it's for my son, Billy. For your son, Billy. Okay, great. So, has Billy had uh, any new medications before, or is this going to be the first? No medications at all. Okay, well, since this is a new medication for Billy, we'd mm -hmm. like to go ahead and um, give you some information to let you know some important things to keep it the safest and work the best for really? him. Well, my wife usually handles all that stuff. You right. want to talk oh, to I me about it? I or? understand. Yeah, if I could just take a few minutes to give you some information and try to give you just kind of the most important things to keep in mind for Billy. Okay. Okay, great. Sure. We well, can go ahead and have a seat. Thank you. You're very <clears> welcome. <throat> Okay, so can I just go ahead and verify some information really sure. quickly? Mm -hmm. So are you still at 500 North Camden Yard Drive? I am, yep. And is this still your phone number? Yep. And Billy's birth date? Yep. Okay, perfect. Okay, so now why did your doctor tell Billy that he's going to be taking this medication? Well, he's having trouble in school. Uh, okay. He's handing in homework assignments, incomplete okay. or late. Sure. He kind of sits there. I mean, he doesn't run around. Right. I so mean, this medication is going to help with that. It's going to help Billy to be able to concentrate a little more and help okay. him to perform those duties in school and things. Yeah, so I don't want his academics to no, hold No, I definitely back. understand. So this is called Concerta. And what it is, is the brand, the, that's the brand name. The generic name is methylphenidate. And what okay. it's going to do is it's actually a stimulant to help his, his, his ability to concentrate and just focus a little better. Really? So, yes. And what did your doctor tell Billy? how he's going to take this medication. I don't know. Okay. I mean, my wife was there. That's I no wasn't problem. even at the appointment. That's why I'm here to help you out. So okay. absolutely no problem. So All he's right. going to take 18 milligram tablets, which look like this, and he's going to take just once, one, one pill a day every morning. And mm. so he's going to wake up in the morning, and he can take it with or without food. This is a medication that's long-acting. So okay. we're going to take it in the morning, and it can last the whole day long to get him through the day and the things he needs to do. There's going to be 30 tablets. Now, there aren't any refills because I think okay. we're just going to try and see how this works for Billy. Okay. And then you're going to go back to the doctor and then make sure that um, if this works for him, we can continue on. If not, try something else. Oh, okay. So just a couple of important things I want you to think about are... Um, with this medication, it can cause a headache. It can cause okay. a headache. It can cause kind of an increased heart rate even. And oh, if gosh. Billy starts to feel heart palpitations, I want you definitely to call the doctor because, you know, that can happen, but we don't want that to interrupt his daily life. Oh, what if he forgets to take one? I, I mean, mornings are kind of crazy right. at my so house. Right, so if he does forget to take it, we want you to take it as soon as you remember. Okay. Now, if he takes it closer to the evening, though, it can cause some insomnia, so we don't want to take it closer to the evening. We want to try to take it first thing in the morning. Oh, gosh. Yeah. Okay. So a lot All of times right. I'll set an alarm or have a note on the fridge to help remember someone okay. so needs to take this. Um, it can also cause some dry mouth, and the biggest thing is it can cause loss of appetite. But we want to okay. make sure that Billy's still eating. So it can just, you know, maybe try some blander, simpler foods, because if you, um, because of the lack of appetite, it can kind of cause a little bit of de decreased energy too. So one, really important to make sure that Billy's eating enough. Okay. The other thing I want you to look for is when you start taking the mes medication, sometimes some mood changes, um, sometimes some irritability. So okay. if those get unmanageable or if it just seems like Billy is really not himself anymore, definitely want you to call your doctor and let her know that okay. these things are happening. How long do you think he's going to be on this? You I know, mean, this could be temporary. It could be a long time. We just need to see how he responds to the medication. And if so, if he does need to be on it for a long time, it's, you know, completely fine and it will help him. And that's the biggest thing. We want Billy to be able to feel focused and feel good about getting the things done that he needs to. One thing I do want to remind you of is that this medication does need to be kept away from other children or other people. It can be habit forming. But since Billy's only going to be taking one a day as it's prescribed, we're not going to worry about that. Um, okay. Just, I wouldn't keep it in the bathroom. There's a lot of humidity in the bathroom, so it kind of can um, affect the tablets. Um, but I know I've given you so much information, it's a little overwhelming, and I talk fast. So can you just repeat back to me how your, he, Billy's going to take this medication? Uh, once a day in the morning. Yes. <coughs> with food might help with the stomach upset. Okay. Okay. Uh, now, food? what other questions can I answer for you today? Uh, nothing else, I guess. Okay. Now, again, if you start to see any kind of mood changes or anything where Billy's not eating or increased heart rate, definitely want you to call Dr. Jones and let her know. Um, okay. But I, I have a lot of confidence in this medication, and I really think it's going to help Billy and, and, and make things a little easier. Great. Great. Well, well thank I you. appreciate your time.